Now, I'm, I'm, I'm not really sure who originally wrote this song, but I remember it being recorded by Mr. Jimmy Little. And I reckon you'll know it, and it's, it's a good way to start our morning. We'll have a bit of a sing-along. It's called Royal Telephone. She walked by. He 
behind her back they called a princess She had the distance in her eyes Oh, the rigor and the princess The dingo and the deal I'll tell you their story December rain fell with a vengeance From a cyclone in the dawn Long dry gullies turned to rivers And the plains became a sea of mud So the boss brought everyone together Family and station It's 
a long story, that one. It's a beautiful story, I reckon, anyway. All right, okay. I reckon, I reckon these have got the best spot sitting out there in the sun. Oh, look, you make me very jealous. I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm a bit of a teddy bear. I like hibernating when it gets cold. I am like a bear because it starts to get cold. I start to eat more and then I want to sleep more. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to do a couple more of my own for you. Uh, this one is on my, my album, on the Bush Kid album. And um, I did mention last night. So I grew up in the bush um, on a property between Roma and St George. Know where those two towns are? Anyone been out that way? Ah, oh, Nindy Gully Pub. Yeah. A lot of good times I don't remember there. <laughs> There's a photo, there's a photo of me on the wall at Indy Gully Pub. Me and a few other people, we went out for the pig races many, many, many moons ago. And um, our little group and I, we all dressed up looking the same. I think it was so we could still find each other when we couldn't walk straight. But um, no, there is, there's a photo of me and my sister and a few friends on the, as you go to walk, well it used to be, as you go to walk out the door to go to the toilet. <laughs> So, I don't know if that's a good thing or, you know, I don't know. Anyway, I'm there. I'm there. So, I'll take that as a claim to fame. And anyway, no, I grew up out there and I always call myself a drought baby. Um, I remember more years of no rain than rain. The year that my parents finally sold up, it rained more than I think it ever has, ever in my lifetime anyway. And by the end of it, um, my mother had been on that place for 46 years. And um, she went, no, that's it, we're done, that's enough. And they um, retired and moved to Toowoomba and they've been pretty happy there, so. Anyway, so this is the probably the very first song I ever wrote and put music to and um, I remember driving back home from down the paddock one day and it's just dust, dirt, nothing much around. Spend all our spare time, well, my spare time in between school, feeding cattle and feeding sheep and, all that fun stuff. Turns out, I'm quite allergic to cotton seed, but I still had to shovel it. Dad's like, oh, I'll just put a scarf over his face and No worries, Dad. Any, anything for the cows. Anyway, this one's just called um, Let It Rain, and at the time, that's just all we wanted. Wouldn't it be good to hear the old 
tries to please his woman, the lady of his life is standing at a party with her hand. She finds him on the balcony, staring at the moon, and holds him in the face he can Just 